Black Mirror's San Junipero is great television because of its optimism. Charlie Brooker's body of work is defined by its pessimism. From the pointed critique of lazy hipster irony in Nathan Barley to the gory satire of reality shows depicted in Dead Set, his work pinpoints the worst of humanity. Black Mirror continues that bleak trend, sometimes to the point of parody. Last night, Brooker won his first Emmy. It was for the only episode of Black Mirror with a happy ending, San Junipero. The relative optimism of San Junipero is what gives this piece of television its magic. The episode from the third season of Black Mirror follows two women as they fall in love in a virtual reality simulation of the 1980s. Kelly is bold with a magnetic personality. Yorkie, played by Halt and Catchfire, Smack NZ Davis, is hesitant and shy, unable to be honest with herself and others even in a simulation. They can only meet for a few hours every weekend, and they do, over and over, on dance floors, beach bungalows and arcades. San Junipero seems like a paradise because it was designed to be. Over the course of the episode we learn that it's a simulation where people's consciousnesses are uploaded after they die. Kelly and Yorkie are both elderly women in care facilities. While Kelly finds San Junipero and the idea of eternal life perverse, Yorkie has spent the past 40 years confined to a hospital bed and can't wait to live in San Junipero full-time.